Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. We're here with another video, baby. And today I'm using my 3XL Square No C-Curve Tips from Bomb Nails. We're gonna be using Cover Bear Me, beautiful cover color, one of my favorites. We're also gonna be using her black painting pot and her gold one. Y'all know I love a little gold. Also the diamond top coat. And y'all know I'm gonna be using my size 14 brand new Kalinske brush from Bomb Nails. I love this brush. Look how flat and beautiful it is, y'all. It's just, ooh, it makes me wanna, ooh. Now y'all, now y'all, it was hot. It was real hot. Now, when it's hot, baby, you don't wanna go in with, oh, look at me, I'm always moving in this chair and then you hear it squeaking in the back of my video. Stay still, baby, stay still. All right, so y'all, it was hot. It was very hot on this day. I went in with a couple big beads on the thumb, y'all, and you could see that they dried a little bit quicker also. I was holding it in my brush a little bit too long, thinking, you know, I was doing something, baby, thinking I was doing something, but baby, I got it together, you know what I'm saying? After this, I was like, yeah, baby, uh, a little bit less beads. When you're, when you're working in the heat, you want to work wetter and not as big, like those big, crusty, musty, dusty beads. Unless you're in the AC and you got, uh, your room is the right temperature, absolutely not. It was about 100 degrees back here, and I was like, yo, let me do a set. Now, this set has come highly requested from one of my girls um i'm so excited about this set uh it was a beautiful set i love my painting pot y'all if y'all don't have the painting pots from bomb nails go get them they are amazing i don't think they're in the bundle anymore but you can buy them separately they are so inexpensive y'all i swear to god her stuff is just so beautifully priced you, you're not breaking your pockets I order from Bomb Nails, y'all, at least maybe once a month, once every other month. I will do a big order or a couple big orders, mostly for my giveaways um, or if I need something extra that I ran out of. Like, I just forgot to get me some cuticle oil, y'all, and I used pretty much all my rose cuticle oil. Y'all know I use that for everything. I use it um, for my nails. I use it for my cuticles. I also use it to condition my brushes. So I have to get me another one of those. So, y'all, I always <laughs> wind up forgetting something. I also, y'all, just got my package today. I'm actually going to make a video with my package. I know I did a live swatching everything, but not everybody likes to watch those long lives um, and all the talking and all the extraness. So I am going to definitely unpackage this, do a video on it. I also got a special collaboration coming up. I'm so freaking excited about it. I'm not telling y'all yet. I also got a creator giveaway coming up, y'all. I, I got so many videos to record, y'all. Like, the day my PR from Bomb Nails came, I got PR from, like, four other companies. So I have so many videos to get out, y'all, plus my collaboration. So I'm just trying to figure out. And I got three videos in the tank right now, and I'm about to do another set with the new collection. So I have so many videos, y'all. I'm, like, ahead of the game right now. So I'm trying to get this one out. So, y'all, you know, just lighten the load a little bit it's always good to have a lot of videos but then when you have stuff coming up and you have to do you know these obligations it's like you know i don't i don't i stopped really doing unboxings on my channel once i started getting better at my application because i really love to do nails what i used to do was do like a video of nails and then i would do an unboxing and then a video of nails and a an unboxing now i like to mostly do nails and my pr for bomb nails i don't really like to do pr a lot for anybody else because i'm so busy with bomb nails and the product that um we're coming out with well gabby's coming out with but we're you know it's a word thing. This is a team effort, you know. Gabby's behind all of it, but, you know, it's a team effort, y'all. So, you know, I have so much product and things like that. Um, so, I mean, I don't represent any other acrylic brands. I only represent, like, gel polish brands and things like that. Um, but it is hard because I have other obligations. So, when you get all these PRs, that's why I don't understand how people are... Uh, Damn brand ambassador for Kiara Sky, not polished, Red Iguana, you know, all these companies. I don't know how they keep up. I don't know. Those are the people you see do one video of a product and then they move on because you have, if when you're getting that much PR, y'all, it doesn't stop. And they randomly send it. They don't even tell you when they're going to send it. I just got a whole box of nail reserve. I didn't even know they were sending it. Not even an email, you know, so... um it gets to be a lot, you know, and 
I am so comfortable and happy to represent the brand that I represent. So I just, I don't know. I just don't care to represent other brands. I just love my, y'all know I'm obsessed. I love my bomb nails. I love Gabby. Um, but I don't represent other acrylic brands. I only represent her acrylic brand. Um, but I love getting gel polishes too. You know, they're always good to put in giveaways. They're good to keep. Gel polishes are a lot of money y'all. So getting them as PR is definitely grateful and I'm grateful for it. But right now, like I said, I gotta, I got a load of videos to do and I'm like, damn, am I gonna have all these PR, like all these videos that are just, you know, so I gotta kind of split them up. And also guys, when you do get a package, these companies aren't, waiting for you you know what i'm saying they want they once they know when you get your package every time i get a package they'll hit me up if i don't hit them up right away oh we see you received your package and then it's like okay ma'am you know i'm a content creator you know i run a channel so i have other content that comes before yours and my bomb nails comes before ev anybody so i'm trying to get these videos out so i could do my other pr for the gel polishes it's just like gel polishes and then i have the creator giveaway that i'm doing which is actually not gel polish. It's something else. So that's a surprise. I'm so excited for that because y'all know I love to give back to y'all. It's such a positive blessing to be able to give back to the girls who um, are here for me, who have been here for me since the beginning. Um, I love y'all. Y'all are amazing. So shout out to y'all. If you're new to this channel, make sure you subscribe. Uh, make sure you like. Make sure you comment. You know, we have a beautiful community here. Um, now, has it always been a positive? No, but we are getting more positive. We are working on that. You know what I'm saying? Just minding our own business and staying, stay progressing. You know what I'm saying? I'm not falling down. I'm progressing. You know what I'm saying? I've lost nothing. I am progressing. I am doing amazing. My girls are doing amazing. Um, some of my girls are getting amazing at their content. Their nails are beautiful. You know what I'm saying? I'm Mar my girl, Latina Nail Design, she's growing beautifully. I'm so proud of these girls and watching y'all grow, Gabby grow. Also, the support that y'all give me um, with bomb nails. Y'all know bomb nails holds a special place with all of us. A lot of my girls are Latina girls um, who love Gabby, who appreciate Gabby, who respect Gabby to the utmost. So I am so thankful for y'all. Um, the support that you give me, not only me, but Bomb Nails is so amazing, y'all. Thank you so much. Her collection sold out within like a day or two. You know what I'm saying? I mean, I bought three. I got three of them, but I didn't buy three. I only bought two, but um, that was a debacle, okay? Okay? I love to support Gabby as well. I think there's more to being a BA than just getting free nail stuff. Um, I think that if somebody, especially for Gabby, she's like the, literally Gabby's on the map. Like anytime somebody mentions bomb nails, they're like, oh, she only has a couple brand ambassadors. I wish I could be a brand ambassador because the PR packages are amazing. It's inclusive and exclusive. She only has two, three BAs. So it's very special thing. I tell you all that all the time. And I, I don't tell you all that to brag because I'm not a braggy person. I tell you all that because this has been such an honor and such a blessing for me. Um, also, just like you, f just the way she makes you feel is so special. Um, and it's a special thing. And I've never heard anybody talk about a BA ship like that. I've heard, like I said in other videos, I've heard horror stories all about BA ships and what people have had to go through, not only from smaller creators, but bigger creators, y'all. And... That's one of the reasons why um, another very large creator I know never took BA ships because of that, because of the struggle that you have to go through. And I don't have to go through none of that. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not even a big creator. Uh, it was a blessing that I even got this. Like I said, like, I'm not a big creator at all. I'm a very, and, and when I got it, I was an even smaller creator. So it's just a blessing. Um, again, I appreciate her so much for giving me all giving me the not only the opportunity but just this beautiful product y'all this product has literally changed I don't even lie about this it has changed my game my application game it's just amazing um I can't wait the brand is growing even bigger the aesthetic is changing the vibe is amazing and oh that's what I was saying um being a brand ambassador is more than just posting one video. It's more than just getting free product. I see a lot of people, especially larger creators, they're brand ambassadors for like 40 different people. 
they get a beautiful package, they use it one time, they do a video of it one time, and then that's it. That's not really a brand ambassador to me. A brand ambassador is somebody who really represents a company. Um, they use their product, um, like, you know, all the time. They let people see the product. You know what I'm saying? They're always showing it. And I really, truly, truly love and support this product, and I stand by it. And that's why I go so hard for it. I make it my number one priority because it is such a beautiful blessing and an opportunity and again i love it i love this is the only product y'all that i can really work with good um that i know how to work with good even when i switch back to my elegance and my valentino i still have trouble with y'all like it either dries too quick or you know something or it doesn't dry fast enough this is just such a perfect acrylic it's medium setting. Um, it doesn't dry too fast, but it doesn't dry too slow. And I just love it. And like I said, that's why I go so hard for it. Um, support, y'all. It's about support, too. You can't expect everything free. The way I support is I buy um, l a large amounts of things for my giveaways for my girls so they could try it. Because not everybody has the money to go buy 10, 15 acrylics. And I love to give back to my girls. Y'all are amazing. Some of y'all are single moms. You know what I'm saying? So I want to give back to the community that supports me and loves me and stands by me. And I have a group of girls that is unmatched. And I'm so proud of each look. Y'all going to make me cry, bro. I am so freaking proud. I'm not even going to shout out names right now because I don't want to miss one. But I am so proud of each and every one of you. Your journey, your growth. I see so much growth in y'all. Your videos. Now, everybody starts somewhere. Um... When I started my channel, if you go back to maybe five months ago, my videos were crap. I wasn't in frame. I had problems. You know what I'm saying? I didn't have a stand. Like, I was doing the most, y'all. I was just trying. And now I semi got it together. I'm still trying to get my lighting together, y'all. But that'll come with time. Um, and I'm just so freaking proud of y'all. Never stop reaching for your goals. If this is something you are passionate about, something you love, do it. Don't, don't even wait another second. I never thought I was always just a watcher, a subscriber, somebody, and I still am. I watch so many girls. I watch so many channels. Um, you know, I try my very hardest to keep up with everybody. We have so many girls that do content now, so it can be kind of hard, especially for the girls who are on the smaller end of the spectrum right now, because YouTube doesn't start really showing your videos on for you pages until you're very consistent. It took me three videos a week to get on that for you page and you can come off of it just as fast as you get on it baby so sometimes that's hard because i'll have to think like you know oh crap let me go check her page see if she wanna so it is hard i also am a full-time worker and a mommy so i'm very busy um but i try my very best to support each and every one of y'all but the growth is so amazing um like i said before i came to youtube i never in a million years thought that I would create content. I was just literally, y'all, uh, I always wanted to do YouTube because, like I said, before I did nails, I did some makeup videos. I bought thousands of dollars worth of really great makeup because I love makeup. I didn't buy it for content. I bought it for myself. I think when I got out of my drug addiction, um, I took the money that I spent on drugs and put it into another addiction, which is shopping. Um, and that's exactly what I did. Uh, I'm not, I don't even think I did that. I definitely did that. <laughs> um, so, but I guess I'd rather spend my money on, you know, beautiful products and beautiful investments than drugs, right? But besides the point, um, I never in a million years thought, y'all, that I would come on here and, and be like a real creator and enjoy it and love it. And I do. Freestyle Fridays, I love. I love being with my girl, uh, Latina Nail Designs. I love going live um, and being with y'all and um, having fun with y'all and having somebody who comes on my platform and has, you know, entertained y'all with me. That is such a blessing for me to see all the people come out and support and love and send me beautiful tips and support this beautiful brand. Y'all, I will forever and always be grateful. And I have learned trials and tribulations on here, going through things that... Um, you can lose those people who love you by certain things. You know what I'm saying? You can um, become, I know there's creators that I have watched that I loved. I, I loved, I loved watching them, their family dynamics. And then it becomes a trend that everybody's fighting and uh, everybody's, there's drama. So, you know, it becomes this trend. People get more views. 
of doing that, you know what I'm saying? So um, it kind of gets old, it kind of gets tiring, and I could totally understand from a watcher's point of view how that can become like relentless and idiotic, and it's like, ooh, I can't even support this person no more, I can't even stomach this person anymore, you know? So definitely growth and changing um, for the better. I'm not gonna be, you know, I've said this in a past video, I'm, this is all about growth, um, finding who you are, what you love, and just doing it, baby. If you think you even want to do this, I was laying, oh, yeah, I was laying in my bed. I used to watch Zule all the time. I used to be in her lives all the time. I was a mod for her for over a year. Um, and I used to have so much fun watching these ladies do nails. Also, my, my friend P, like, I loved watching them do nails. They do bomb nails. And I never thought in a million years that I would also be on this platform. Um, you know, my friend, uh, you know, got me into it now before all of this I wanted to do nails because during COVID my girl sold her parlor and I didn't know it I hadn't got my nails done like in six months because I used to get my nails done for like faithfully for a year but then I would give them like time to breathe you know because you always want to do that you don't want to keep filling or you know whatever I always gave my nails a couple months to breathe so I went like six months without nails what I used to do was get the E and C um dip over my natural nail and um, I went back up. I was like, oh, I need to go get my nails done. It's been a while. I go up. Place is dead. Didn't know she sold it. Didn't look at the reviews because I had been going there for so long. And I walked out with the worst nails. And I always loved watching application. I always, I want to do that. You know, I want to do that. So, so many times I went on websites to get me everything I needed. And it was a lot of money. So I was like, do I really freaking need all this? Because this is just going to turn into this. I'm going to need this. I'm going to need that. No. So I would fill up a cart in multiple places, Amazon, Zulie, everywhere. And I wouldn't even buy this stuff. And then one night I was like, screw this. And I went for it, y'all. And I spent like over $1,300 getting everything I needed, drill, lamp, everything. And it all came. And I remember I was sitting in my room because I forgot how bad monomer smelled because in New York, the last time I smelt monomer, y'all, was years ago because we don't do that here in New York anymore. The salons, at least, not the private people, the salons, it's all dip powders now up here. I think just up here, maybe the city you could get acrylics, but upstate, nah, nah, it's all dip. You can't even talk about, oh, you do acrylic? No, 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 dip. So I just got the dip. So I hadn't smelt monomer in a long time. So I opened up the monomer in my room. I got the Young Nails kit. I got some acrylics from Zule. I got the acrylics that obviously came in the Young Nails kit, which is a bomb kit, by the way, for beginners. If you ever want to be, it comes with literally everything you need to start nails. Um, except the brush. You want to get yourself a nice brush because that brush, no bueno. Anyway, so I started to do like a swatch, like on... Like a nail thing, I was I was gluing toothpicks to like the nails they give you to make like a swatch stick because I didn't have swatch sticks. And I remember picking up my first bead. Now, mind you, I was using Young Nails. They give you a white uh, blush cover and, and they're all fast drying, y'all. These are not beginner kits at all. <laughs> like the acrylic that comes in them is not beginner. So I remember picking up my first bead, putting it down, and it was a wreck, y'all. And I'm like, Wow. This is not as easy as it looks, y'all. It took me time. So finally, after being, I was devastated. I was devastated. I said, wow, I should have just got this beginner kit and went off with the beginner kit because I just bought all this shit and I can't even lay a freaking bead, dude. This shit is dry. I couldn't do it. And the smell was outrageous. I couldn't, I thought I was going to pass out, y'all. <laughs> I gassed out my whole house. My brother came running out of his room. He's like, oh my God, what is that smell? It smelled in here for like a day. So anyway, y'all, I was so freaking devastated. I'm sitting in my room crying like, no way. I just spent all that money on this stuff and you're done. <laughs> you're done. So I put, I hung it up and I said, no. Get you a new brush. Get Wait for your Kalinske brush and just wait. Maybe that'll make a difference, okay? Just wait. Don't give up yet because I'm one of those people, if it doesn't work the first time, I don't try, try again. I give up and move on to the next. Um. So anyway, so I finally got my Kalinske brush. My very first Kalinske brush was from Zule. It was my, the unicorn handle. I still have them. Um. And once I got a 100% Kalinsky brush, it made the biggest difference. I don't know if the one I had was like 
That Young Nails one that, that comes in that kit is not full Kalinske. It looks like black German Shepherd hair. It's not full Kalinske. Full Kalinske is, as you see here, it's a light below and it gets darker towards the tip. That is a real full 100% Kalinske. That's how you know it's 100% Kalinske. This thing they gave me, I don't know what it was. It was definitely not 100% Kalinske. But when I got my new brush, I could see the freaking difference. I was like, okay, now I could work with this. The first set of nails I did, y'all, were better than the salon. Better than the salon. Better. I don't even know how. Filing, y'all. Filing comes in clutch. <sighs> so anyway, so yeah, we're just finishing up application here. But y'all, I almost gave up before I started. And now look at me. I mean, I'm not the best. I'm still very much a beginner. I'm still very much learning. I still very much flood my cuticles. I still very much make some nails very big, thick, and lumpy. I still very much, uh, you know, am learning. This is a learning process. With nails, you learn every day something new. Something new is trending. Something new happens. Every day you learn something new. And that's kind of what I love about this. It's so diverse. Like, there's always something to learn. But I have come a long way, y'all, on my journey here. I just got a reminder from TikTok the other day. And it was when I first started my channel. I had 150 subs, y'all, eight months ago. Eight months ago, I had 150 subs. I had 150 subs and 10 videos and about 10 views on each video, y'all. No lie. No freaking lie. It's possible, y'all, with the right... With the right support system, with the right encouragement, you can go to wherever you want in the world. You could be whatever you want to be. Consistency is key. Support is key. Um, even, even with the little bit of uh, reach I have on this channel, my girls, the girls in this community are growing. They're growing. They're growing. Whether whether people think they are from a shout out or not, it helps. It does help. It absolutely helps. Um, and I shout my girls out because I love them. I shout girls out because I care. And I shout girls out because I want to see them win. I have never, ever, ever hated or been malicious to anybody on YouTube. I genuinely want to see these girls win. And they're winning. They're winning, bro. And I freaking love that. I love that for them. Um, tabs, tabu tabulations, I don't know where she came from. She came out of the woodwork, baby. She hopped on YouTube and said, baby, this is what it is. She does such good little uh, nail reviews. I love it. Uh, she's just so freaking professional on her channel. The lighting is great. Her, I just love that. Um, Latina Nail Designs co is coming so far. She's grow. I just love y'all. And y'all are growing. And the hard work and consistency is going to pay off, y'all. I promise you, with the right love, support, and consistency and drive, anybody can come on here and do this and be successful. Okay? Now, you have to love this. This is not something that is for money. You cannot be in this for money. Um, you have to be in this because you love it. You love the community. You're here to meet people and, you know, just have have a good time doing nails. And that's what I'm here for, y'all. I love Freestyle Fridays. Like I said, I love going live whenever with y'all. Um, and I love making content. I love talking to myself in these voiceovers. Like, I just love it. It's just so amazing. And I'm so glad that I didn't give up. And I'm so glad that I'm still here and I'm so glad that um, my fortunes and all my blessings are not gone because, you know, sometimes, like I said, my mouth, you know, it gets a little rough. But, um, you know, it's all out of love and care and respect for my girls. And it really hurts me to see anybody hurt them. So really, from the outside looking in, people don't know. But that's what it is. I just genuinely love these girls. They support me. They give their all to me. And I have to love and support them back. I have to show them and be there for them when 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 things happen to them. And, um, you know, by doing that, that can lead to other things. But I don't, like I said, I don't regret nothing I've ever done. People come in and out of your life um, at times in your life to teach you lessons, um, to give you blessings, to do whatever it may be. And sometimes those, those uh those friendships don't last. I think they say statistically every 10 years you lose all your friends. Like every 10 years you get a new set of friends. Friends, not all friends last forever. Not all friends are genuine. You know what I'm saying? And sometimes you got to part ways, you know. 
Um, some girls, like, I don't know how anybody else feels. I know there's a lot of creators who are really cut and dry, but I have really found some girls on here that I really care about, that I really love, that I would hang out with in real life. Um, and there's a p emotional part to that. You know what I'm saying? These aren't just girls that come in my lives. Um, these aren't just girls that send me, you know, gifts and things like that. These are girls that I care about in real life. You know what I'm saying? So it's definitely hard. I'm not the type of creator that can separate the two. Um, if you show me love, respect, and loyalty, I, I that's what I'm giving back to you. Um, and like I said, I have made so many genuine friendships on here. Friendships that it's hard for me to separate. You know what I'm saying? Because I love gr the, you know, the people who support me and the girls who do love and support me and our mission and what we're doing. I genuinely love and care for them. I can't cut that off. That's just the type of person I am. I can't be cut and dry where I only talk to these girls in a live video and, you know, ignore them the rest of the time. It's just not me. I'm a very social butterfly. Oh, we're using my Melody Sue. Shout out to Melody Sue, baby. This is the MR5 drill. And if you need a drill, baby, page 12. Give you, I think it's 12% off. Yeah, page 12. Duh, 10%, 12. 12% 12 off, y'all. Oh, I have an unboxing for them, too. Oh, my God. I got so much PR, y'all. So, anyway, since I blathered. Oh, I think I even blathered through the ASMR. Oh, hell no. I always do that, y'all. I'll leave a little bit of filing ASMR in here for y'all, and I'll freaking talk through it. Um... But anyway, y'all, I freaking love y'all. I can't wait till you see these little designs. Aaliyah, you're going to love these. She's been asking me to do a V French forever. Um, I enjoy these. They came out beautiful. I actually really love black. Um, it, when I used to get my nails done, they were always black French. When I used to get them painted. Now, when I used to do the dip, I would do like an accent nail and then everything else. Very neutral, nudie, pinks. You know, same stuff I like now, but a lot less drastic. Um, but yeah, I love these. They came out so good. I love this drill, y'all. Um, I can't wait to show you all my Melody Susie unboxing. That's going to be fun. Um, but yeah, I really love my MR5 drill. This is a bomb drill, y'all. Um, I actually was talking to them. Remember the live that I couldn't open it? It was very hard to open. They told me they have double locking mechanisms. Um, I don't think it should be that hard to open, but they said that's what it is. It's a safety mechanism, so your drills don't get loose, and baby, it don't get loose. Um, but they told me if it was that hard to open, that they would send me a new hand piece. Um, but yeah, other than that, Melody Susie for, for hardware all day long. I love Melody Susie. People spend all this outrageous money on, like, Kiara Sky, uh, not polish lamps, but Melody Susie has the best drills, hands down. I've seen so many people have problems with Kiara Sky Drills, lamps, all of that. And there's so much freaking money, dude. Like, why is a drill 400 and something dollars? This drill cost me $160 plus um, Melody Suji gives you a discount usually. And then I think you can use my discount as an extra discount. But y'all, hands down, they have the best hardware ever. And I stand by them and I don't think I'd ever use another brand drill you, uh, maybe a Manny passport but that's for like professional use if you do other people's sales not for like I do my own like I got, probably could have kept my $50 one off of Amazon but I needed I needed this drill when I seen it come out in the rose gold the pink roll I was like yes baby but anyway y'all let me stop blathering I didn't blather through the whole application y'all I love y'all um I'm about to do a video of my box that I got from Bond Nails. I'm about to redo my swatches because like I said, people like to see the videos. Uh, so people don't always like to watch lives. Three hour lives. I did my nails in the video. You know, people want to see clear swatches. Also, lives aren't always that clear. Um, you know, so I want to make a nice video. These glitters, this new collection, the Kawaii collection was a beautiful collection, y'all. It is restocking again. She is restocking it sometime this week. Um, for those who have not got it, she will be restocking it one more time. I, I'm pretty sure she usually does it one more time. Um, go get you this collection, y'all. It was so freaking beautiful. And it is not like one of those chunky glitters that don't have enough clear in it. One thing about Gabby's freaking glitters is they're going to come with enough clear in it. I have bought glitters from many places. And one thing I cannot stand is a dry ass glitter that you have to add 
clear to, okay? Every time I've ever gotten any glitters from Gabby, they always had more, a good amount of clear. I love more clear than glitter. Now, obviously not too much clear, but I do like to see the clear. I do like to see, oh, wow, there's clear in here. You know what I'm saying? Not just chunky glitter that you that just, like, falls off the nail. No, we don't like that. And I've had that from a few people that I've gotten glitter from where I had to add my own. These are beautiful, y'all. They are beautiful. They are unique. I have never seen a collection like this with butterflies, flowers. This was the ultimate summertime beautiful collection. I am in love. I'm obsessed. Like, I don't even think y'all, these butterflies, y'all know me in butterflies. Wait till y'all see my sheen haul. Y'all are going to be like, hell nah. Hell nah. So I'm going in with my matte top coat here. If y'all don't know, I like to go in with a top coat. Um, This is my Bomb Nails matte. It's a great matte. Um, Very smooth. Oh, I love it. It's so beautiful, y'all. This makes your artwork freaking smooth. It won't bleed anywhere. Not that it would bleed because I am actually going to be using the Art Gel Painting Pots. These don't bleed at all, y'all. They're nice and thick and yummy. Um, that's the difference between Art Gel and regular polishes. Um, regular polishes tend to be a little bit more liquidy than nail art gels. But these, y'all, I'm obsessed. I love them. Um, the black that I'm using in here is not Bomb Nails black. Only the black that I'm using for the lines is. The other black that I'm using in here is uh, another brand's black. Um, I didn't get my black polish from Bomb Nails when I did this. I wish I had because baby, baby. We're also going to be doing some 3D work in here. And I wish I had my th new 3D brush. But baby, we're, we're here now. We got it. And that black and white gel polish from Bomb Nails, yo. First of all, it's no white. Who, who even knew that was a thing? All of the blacks that I own are white. Every black that I only own one or two blacks. But both of them are white. You have to wipe them. Um, Yeah, and I just never seen it. I love it. It's amazing. So yeah, here I'm going in with my 20 millimeter brush, baby. And we're going to get to line in. You know what I'm saying? I was scared to do these because, y'all, these could be a little tricky. And I did a little bit shorter, y'all. Because the longer you go with these type of Frenches, the harder they are. So I said, let me do like a medium length set. To me, this is like a medium length. This is the length I would get in real life if I wanted longer nails. I probably would never go any longer than this. Just saying. But yeah, y'all, watch the application. Not the application. We're over that, baby. We're on to paint and watch this. Oh, and these liner brushes make it so freaking easy to do line work. Like, it's just a good, once you get your paint throughout those bristles, baby, and you just <sighs> slide it through. It's the, this black is freaking amazing. Freaking amazing. And the amount of product that comes in here for the price, I'm not going to mention any names, but I got pots, gel pots from somebody that were $15 a pop. I got five, the whole collection for over a hundred freaking dollars, y'all. And the bottom of the, it was a little tiny, but I still have them. They're very disappointing. The bottom, it's like a, a little tiny cover at the bottom of the pot, and that's it. These painting pots, you see how thick these are? This product, I can stick this whole brush in, and it will, that's how deep it goes. That is how deep it goes, okay? It's not a little bottom, a little tiny bit at the bottom, no. These are full of product, and for the price, for the price, this on another woman's website would have been $50 for those four. I guarantee it. Guaranteed. And I think the painting pots are $9.99 a pop on her website. Plus, she gives a $15. No, nobody's beating her, dude. Uh, she's literally El Chapo of the nail game, okay? I don't know what she's doing over there in El Paci. El Paci over there. Little El Paci, little El Paci. Somebody sneaking over to Border Gabby. Sneaking over. You sneaking over to bring that acrylic back for us? Some products, baby? You sneaking over because what? Yes, baby. She sells this product for an affordable price. And it's so... Look at this black, baby. Look at it. It's amazing. I love it. All right. I said I was going to stop blathering. I got some content to create, baby. So uh, enjoy the rest of the video, whatever we got left. I love y'all. If y'all haven't hit that subscribe button, go hit it. I promise you will not be disappointed. Also, every Friday at 8 p.m., I do go live. Sometimes I, I go live with another creator. Sometimes I go live by myself. We never know. You know what I'm saying? But any, either way, it's a, it's a blast. We also do random giveaways every month. So make sure you all come Freestyle Fridays, chill, relax. 
sit back and be entertained, baby, because that's what we are. We're entertainers, baby. We're entertainers. All right, everybody, have a great day, great night, wherever you're at. I love you, and I'll be back, baby. Yeah, I'll be back. Oh, cur-
Thank you.